our next section will be section 4 which says about prohibition of the transfer of this granted lands so the subsection 1 of section 4 first say about the act before the act or after the act which act this Karnataka SCST prohibition of transfer of certain lands act if there was any transfer or there is any transfer then it shall be null and void and this transfer shall not carry any right title or interest on such land so it is not going to be conveyed with the transfer or if there is deemed that it the right the title the interest will be conveyed by this transfer then it is not going to be conveyed because it is invalid transfer so deemed ever to have been conveyed means there can be any law or agreement contract or instrument which is which is saying yes it will be conveyed on such transfer but it is a granted land so it will not be conveyed because it is an invalid transfer so it is so because it is in contravention of the terms of the grant of such land so government while granting such land to the SAST community person it will have certain terms so this transfer will be considered against in contravention of the terms of such grant or there can be certain law which is providing for granting of land to SAST community person by the government so the transfer will be considered to be against that is in contravention of such provisions of such law which is granting the land to SCST community person or it can be as per subsection 2 so what is this subsection 2 subsection 1 was about transfer before or after commencement of this Karnataka SCST PTCL Act but subsection 2 is only for any transfer made after the commencement of this Karnataka SCST PTCL Act if it is after this act that there is any transfer then it has to be ha as per the permission of the government so the person who wants to transfer that he will be a CST candidate he has to take permission to transfer such granted land or if any person who want to acquire such granted land he has to take permission from the government so the person who want to acquire may be from a CST community or he may not be but he has to acquire permission he has to get permission from the government and this sub uh, subsection 1 and subsection 2 of section 4 is also applicable for any sale of such granted land is applicable if such sale is through execution of a order or decree of a civil court or even uh, any other authority if it is ordering or it is giving an award stating that yes there can be a sale of such land such granted land and the if they give such order award or uh, decree then it is prohibited as per subsection 1 and 2 